James Hicks and Shane Staggs. John St. Clair will throw it up. Indiana in the powder blue. Indiana State, powder blue. Gordon Gophers in the road maroon. We are underway, second round of the NIT. All five starters in double figures, and it's really a positionless offense. Jumpers up and in for Isaiah Swift. Anytime it goes into that low post, especially to Payne. Mitchell feeds it across for Payne. With two on the shot clock, he lays it up and in. 101 to 92. They were down 13 in the second half of that game. Swope. Whoa. Hesitation, he scores. Explosive. You see the little hesitation, stop and go. Comes back to his right and finishes with the left hand. Swope averaging 16 a game, 10th in the Valley. Open jumper for Garcia. Good job by Pharrell Payne corralling the rebound. He'll attack the rim and dunk it. Getting back in transition and then taking care of the defensive backboard. That time, they couldn't get the rebound. Pharrell Payne averages six rebounds a game. Three from the corners up and in for Ryan Conwell. This is Elijah Hawkins, who is second in the country in assists. Inside for Payne. Four on the shot clock. Mitchell's mid-range jumper goes. A chance there, that offhand. Couldn't be called for that one. Hawkins back irons the three. Rebound Jason Kent running out slope. Lays it up and in. And that's that bookending that coach talked about. The defensive rebound starting the break. Turnover. Running the floor. Three on one. To the rim and a score. Coach Schultz told us the team was devastated. And they didn't really practice well for a couple days after that announcement. But he's gotten them back on track trying to pursue an NIT championship. Three's up and in for Conway. Hawkins pounding the ball into the floor. Mid-range jumper is up and in. Patience on that possession and got it in the lane for a short. Oh my goodness. Conwell the three is good. A lot of people point to that game as the springboard to college basketball coming to another level in the public consciousness in this country. That's how big a deal it was. Fox gets the roll and it started a decade-long NBA rivalry between Magic Johnson and Larry Bird. Want to look at it either way, Sycamores have the ball. Sycamores has six assists on eight baskets. Oh, the How about seven assists on nine baskets? Look at the awareness of the court. Great basket cut. He Coach Johnson played at De La Salle High School, was an All-State player in basketball and football as Avalar buries the three. Here's their point guard, Julian Larry. Conwell has three threes. Make it four. He has 14 already. Quick three for Christie and a big shot. If that doesn't go, you're like, Indiana State looking to extend the lead back out. It's been cut to 12. It's turned over. Cam Christie's got it for Minnesota. Gophers on the run with numbers. Christie stolen away. And now an uncontested run out for Julian Larry, who will dunk it. Indiana State. This will be as easy a basket as they get all day. And they've had some easy ones. 12 point lead for the home team. Fox. Hook shot is up and in. Parker Fox, five quick points off the bench. Hawkins is out of that out of the game now with what appeared to be a hip injury. Payne attacks the rim and scoops it in. And give Minnesota credit. They were down 18 in this game on the road. Crowd's going wild, and now they're down by just eight. What have they done better? Get some of the guys involved. That's what they wanted, and that triggered them. They've only made two threes, but they made their last two, and that got them going. Avila scores in a foul. Look at this ball screen, quick release. How quickly they make the right reads. If they're not going to get some weak side help there. Here's Payne at seven points, five rebounds in the first half. Backing in Avila, two on the shot clock. Payne dunks it with authority. That's a good percentage shot. That time they went back in there again and he paid it off. Oh, look at the passing. <laughs> Kent scores in a foul. It's just unbelievable. They are having so much fun together. He's just made the great pass. And of course, when they won 33 games, this could be win number 30. Payne and a chance for three. Pharrell Payne has been Minnesota's go-to guy, and Avila may be hurt. Now they start cheating to help on the post on Payne, and he made the proper pass. Back to a cut for Conwell. He's fouled and no, not fouled. Just spanks it in. They're all able to take it to the team. 
Haynes saves it back inbounds to Mitchell. Finds a wide open man, Hawkins. Up fakes, dribbles it down low for Payne. Good who will rock pass. the rim? That's why they threw in the middle. The big guy kicked it to the corner for three. They run their offense through their big men. Foul on the three, chance for four. Conwell having a day. I mean, that is deep. Coming right, shooting it with his left hand. Oh, getting fouled for good measure. And still played one season at Michigan State. Well, I go find Krusty again. Oh, oh huge four. three, Mike four. Mitchell. <laughs> you can just do that. On a steal. Yeah. Turnovers, too. Good active hands by the Gophers. Mitchell to Payne, who missed the lane. Oh, he scores! Knocked away, four to shoot. Christie with two, shoots it from 19, and scores! Cam Christie has nine. 11 and a half to go, an 11-0 run for Minnesota. Down the lane, Larry scoops it up and in. That's a good decision there. They're really overplaying now. Xavier Bledson is in the game, number zero for Indiana State. Here's an open three from the left wing. Banked it in! Jason Kent called the bank. It's the midway point of the second half. Long two for Mitchell. Rebounded by Avila. Sycamore's on the run. Julian Leary head up the court. Zigzagging down the floor. Julian Leary lays it up and in. Quick three, Garcia. No, a long two, a long two for Garcia. Numbers for the Gophers. Mitchell open three. It's good. Big shot, Mike Mitchell. Oh, that's... Several opportunities to fold today. The determination that both teams are playing with. Yeah. Avila will go to the line for three. Fill the entire game. But fighting is the operative word. They are playing with great determination. Larry down the lane, lays it up and in. No, he does so well. Three is up and in. No, another long two. I'm giving Garcia credit. He was all discombobulated to fix the signal to the bench. Mitchell and Christie with 10. Larry to the rim, lays it in. He is just dynamic. They're now 14 of 18. Minnesota's just 8 of 15. Christie fumbled the dribble. Long pass ahead for Kent. He'll dunk it! smile on his face. Kent with authority. He's having a very big game. 10 rebounds, 14 points. Pharrell Payne the rebound. Mitchell the three. It's good. Timeout, Minnesota. Fought valiantly, but this is a tough place to play in Indiana State. Moves on. Sycamores go wire to wire and win it 76-64. Win number 30 for Indiana State. Takes us to the NIT quarterfinals. This is the first of five games in the NIT today. But the quarterfinal matchup is said it'll be the Cincinnati Bearcats coming here to Terre Haute to take on the Indiana State Sycamores on Tuesday at 9.